All right, perfect. Now that we have it bookmarked, let's do what we're going to do at the beginning of every time you come to my class. It doesn't matter if you're in remote or in person or we're on a field trip or whatever, you always check in on the website, okay? You never, I mean, I never go around the room and marking who's here or I look at the Google Meet and I'm like, okay, who's here? Check, 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 check. The only way I do attendance, remember when I said in the intro that we don't do summatives and uh, formatives, but we have things that we have to do in their place? The check-in is one of them and let me show you why. So on the front page of the website, every day without fail, you will go here and go to the student check-in form right here. So I'm gonna click on that. That just opens up a Google form. It will already capture your ACS email, so you don't need to worry about that. And then you just say your name. It's the name that I, you mostly get called. So uh, Brad Flickinger is, is and, I'm, and I go by Brad, although my first name is Charles, but I go by Brad. You don't have to put your full name in there, just put Brad. And then what station are you sitting at? Um, this is for contact tracing right now. So let's say I'm sitting at station seven. Uh, there is a choice there if you're in remote learning, just pick remote learning. Um, as uh, I think there's also one just for extra, yeah, extra. But uh, uh, pick the one for remote learning if you are at home or just uh, whatever desk you're at. That's in case we need to do any contact tracing. We know exactly where you were sitting during this class period. And then of course, who was sitting near you. Okay, which tech two are you working on today? Now, if this is your very first day doing it, you might just come down here and go undecided. But if you're doing something already, let's say I'm in uh, digital music level three, you know, I'm going to pick that, whatever you're working on today. All right. And now this next one is to kind of help you decide, you know, are you, are you on pace for things? You know, like, have you been, you know, keeping up with what you should be doing? And so you can say, hey, I just started or I'm about to finish. This helps me know where you're at. You're on pace. You're like, oh, man, I've been, I've been on this a little too long. So I might be saying I'm way behind. I need to finish this or I need to work on a different tech too. So tell me where you are honestly. Okay, like how do you feel you are for pacing? Okay, and what are you working on? And I need a full sentence. So I just can't, you just can't say, hi, Mr. Flick or blah. You need to give me a full sentence because this, when I meet with your parents or I meet with the principal and we look at how you're doing in my class, we need to know what you're doing from class to class. So since I'm in digital music level three, I can just say today I am recording the vocals to my original original song that should be ready next week. Because remember, I just, I just told myself, Mr. Flick, that I'm a little behind. Okay, so, so I'm recording the vocals for my original song. Uh, do you need my help? Okay, so we can just say, no, I'm fine. And if you ever say yes to this, that uh, puts a little red flag on my computer, so I know that I need to help you, as well as uh, send me an email in, or, or put your hand up if we're in class. But it just kind of lets me know where you're at. So I'll just say, no, I'm fine, and comment. And then you don't have to put anything down here. You can just put something in there. Don't put anything silly in there. Uh, don't, yeah, just, just leave it blank if you don't have any comments. And hit submit. And now it's official. You have signed into my class, and I will mark you present on the attendance.